Hi, my name is Andrea, and today I'm sharing a simple and delicious recipe for stick of butter rice. This recipe has been around for decades, and it's one of my family's favorite side dishes. So let me show you what you're going to need. You're going to need some French onion soup, beef broth, one stick of unsalted butter cut into slices, and you're also going to need one cup of rice. You can use any rice you'd like to, except for a quick cooking rice like minute rice. Also, I've never tried this with a brown rice, only white rice. So right now I'm using basmati, but long grain rice or jasmine rice would work just fine. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna do is pour your rice into the bottom of a eight by eight pan and then you're gonna add your beef broth right on top. Now make sure that you use condensed beef broth and not just a regular old can of beef broth. You definitely wanna make sure that it is condensed. Otherwise, it's gonna to be too much moisture in your rice and it's not going to cook out. Then you're gonna add your can of French onion soup. And I'm just gonna stir it around a little bit. And next, you're gonna add your pats of butter right on top. Now, do make sure that you use unsalted butter because with all of the ingredients in this uh, casserole dish or side dish, it is salty enough. Make sure that you're using unsalted and make sure that you're using real butter, not margarine. This is a really rich and indulgent side dish and that butter just kicks it up a notch. Okay, I've got my oven preheated to 400 degrees. I'm just gonna cover this with foil. I'm gonna let it bake for half an hour covered, and then I'm gonna uncover it and bake it for another half an hour. Okay, so it's been half an hour and this is what it looks like. I just took the foil off. I'm gonna continue to bake this for another half an hour. Okay, so it's been half an hour. I just took it out of the oven. You can probably hear it steaming a little bit. So I'm gonna let this cool for just a, I don't know, about five minutes or so, and um, then I'll fluff it up and I'll bring you guys back. Okay, so here is the rice. I let it cool for just a couple of minutes, not long at all, and then I just took a fork and fluffed it up a little bit, and here it is. It is so rich and indulgent, savory, buttery. It's absolutely delicious. If you all enjoyed this recipe, I have an entire playlist of quick and easy recipes that I will link in the description box. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we'd love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.